Welcome to another episode. Let's give up the gems 100. All right. Now this is got kind of kind of gonna be quick because I ain't got that much space on my phone. Got like four minutes. I I do want to elaborate a lot on this 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 subject this issue this matter. So I might make a part two to this. You know what I'm saying? I'm have to delete some shit off my phone or whatever the case is. But I definitely gotta speak on this shit. All right. All right. I see on YouTube a lot of people that promote a lot of negativity just for views. All right. A lot of black people. We promote a lot of bullshit just for the attention the shit gonna get because we know that we trying to make money off our videos and the drama and the negativity overall brings a lot of people to watch the videos. Regardless of how the shit making us look, we don't even think about shit like that. We don't even consider that we're selling our fucking selves out just for money. And when we see other motherfuckers do it, then we want to speak up like hypocrites. So, this dude, Queens Flip, I'm not really sure what the fuck he's known for, really. He, um, usually around battle rap, you know, do blogs on battle rap, things like that. Um, he'll be at events, battle rap events, but I'm not sure what he's famous for or whatever, but people know this nigga. Um, he has a podcast, and this is his show right here. I'm li we're looking at. They're actually, these three young, young people that you see sitting here, they're actually the subject of this show is the nigga you see right there taking phone calls asking people what's their favorite drug and these motherfuckers are not talking about weed or simple shit that you would think actually he just popped a xanax to start this whole show off while drinking haitian rum this is in his own words the chick next to him her right there she's also on on xanax I didn't see when if she took it, but this this black girl she definitely took that shit, and I believe they they all they drink it, you know all three cups, they all got alcohol in their cups. This is what the fuck this show this episode whatever is promoting. Now, let me just make it clear that this this whole podcast shit right here is ratchet. They deal with a lot of ratchetness. The first time I start, I watched the shit, it was niggas on there talking about giving head and bitches that don't give head and all this other nasty shit, eating ass and everything like that. So this show is surrounded or predicated on some, some negative bullshit. Some ratchet shit that, you know, the um the motherfuckers on the low frequency or whatever, they grasp to shit like this. They gravitate to shit like this. Um so listen to how he takes a phone call and how he asks the dude what's his favorite drug and listen to the dude's response. Listen, what's your favorite drug? The only drug, way you'll be passed out if, it's, if, if the drug, vibe is nigga? boring. What's your favorite drug? You know that. What's, what's my favorite drug? Yes. Are you going to answer, sir? My favorite drug is Annie's. Oh. Wow. Oh, wow. You hear that? 2018. Nigga sound like an urban youth, probably a black nigga or whatever. You ask him what's his favorite drug, and his response is Xanax. Narcotic, pills, man-made. You know what I'm saying? This is this is where we're at right now in time. So I'm going to leave it off right here, and I'm going to make a part two.